Hi, I'm Rick Barnes, Facility Supervisor of Security at Scarborough Hospital. I'm Kevin Bisundi, our Shift Supervisor of Security at Scarborough Hospital. Follow us and we'll show you a day in the life of security. What just happened there is we had an individual smoking on property. Uh, they were by the fence, so we just issued him a smoking infraction. It's just a warning, no fine involved. He showed us his ID, we took his information, uh, his patients had emerged, and now he's returning to the patient. With our database that we have in the system, to track them for future references. If it's a multiple offense, at that point we issue a trespass, banning them from the property. Well, now we're back at the Security Command Center. This is where we do our investigations and also monitor CCTV uh, cameras. We have over 200 cameras in the hospital, at uh, which point, if we need to conduct an investigation, what may it be on an accident or an incident that took place in the hospital, we would take place of it right here. There's also other remote areas in the hospital that we do have cameras set up where if we needed a quiet area, we can investigate. Uh, there is a lot of high traffic coming in and out of this office, whether it be patrol officers or uh, staff coming in for ID badges, which are also done in this uh, center. If we need to get a license plate, we can actually uh, grab it right off of these cameras, and this is something that we assist Toronto Police with should they have a crime that they're investigating. Uh, this office is also used for writing reports, so whenever we attend a call, we always have to report whether or not there was violence or if it was just an access call. Everything is logged so all the guards can document exactly what we've done for the day. So now we're going to leave the office and continue with our patrols of the hospital and uh, follow us. So what this was that Rick just hit was an uh, electronic uh, detects point. This is actually our electronic patrol that TSA uses to track the patrol security does. It also accumulates stats monthly that's submitted to upper management to ensure that places are being controlled on a timely and efficient manner. We're actually on the outside of our more facility at TSH. This is uh, where the deceased are being released to the funeral homes. We have 16 uh, shelves. When an officer does come into the morgue, we fill out a logbook here. The logbook starts off with the date and time, then the officer's name and signature, then we have the funeral home's name and signature along with that. Before we, we release any body, we have to check a death certificate. Now when that death certificate comes in our hands, we check the logbook to make sure the name matches the same. And when we pull the body out, we have to check both the toe tag and the bag name. And if there's any spelling corrections, then we have to send it back to bed allocation in which they get the nursing staff involved. Excuse me. Security. That call. Security. What we just experienced was a stat call to Tower 10. Uh, normal experiences that we uh, deal with on a stat call are usually irate patients, agitated patients, agitated visitors, and disruptive people. A stat call ensures that security runs to that location. In a situation like this, uh, we've already got intel that it's all clear inside the room, and my partner is actually just currently clearing the room, ensuring that no one else needs any further help. Patients come down, so we're good to clear. Sounds good.
So we're currently on the roof of tower. Now uh, we can oversee most of Scarborough here and also the whole property of TSH. Ideally on a code yellow, which is a missing person, a guard would actually come up here and if you can look out into the distance, you can actually see the overflow parking. So it's very easy to see down the distance if a patient is on route and if we need to call Toronto police to get them back and what, what uh, direction that they're heading in. And, and that's, that's a day, day in the, the life, life of a security, security guard. guard.